CD Networks Cloud Life is an all-in-one video platform for broadcasting. And in this video, I'll present an overview of how to set up a live streaming on Cloud Live. Here is the dashboard page where you can see some general metrics. From the channels we can access all the channels that are ready for broadcast. Here, let's start by creating a new channel. Click Create Channel to create a new one. You can assign a title for the channel. Also you can choose the scenarios or put an introduction on the channel for a better management. For other settings you may leave it as default. Most of these settings can be modified in the future so don't worry. Now let's go straight to finish. Once the channel is ready, we can see it available in channel list. Next, we'll set up the encoder and start our stream pushing. In this video, I'll use OBS Studio, a very powerful and free encoding software. I'll click Start, third-party encoder and copy the server address. For now, only RTMP address is displayed but it will be also possible if you want to use other protocols such as SRT. After that, we'll get back to OBS Studio and go into Settings. Start from Settings Stream. Now I'll paste in the server address info into server. Once the settings are OK, click Start Streaming. The green light in the corner let us know the stream is proceeding. And a few moments later, you can see the status of the channel changed into broadcasting. I'll click Codes. As you can see here we have three different codes for playback. Copy the adaptive code and paste it in the browser and click Play. Now you can see the broadcast directly because CD Networks player is embedded in this code. Or, you can use streaming pulling URL and paste the URL into player such as VLC and PoPlayer to load it up and have a playback. Add to that. Cloud Life also have some additional features lets you monitor how the broadcast is going. Real-time monitor. Provide some great data for you to have an exact view on how your streaming is going now. You can see the performance data such as frame rate, bitrate, and latency. From monitor history, you can find all the records and broadcast history with streaming duration, viewer counts and streamer IPs. Also, you can click Start Recording on Monitor page to record your streams for playback as video on demand or restream as a live recording. Here you can review the recorded streams as videos on CloudVOD under Video Libraries. And let's get back to Cloud Live, to find more info of your live streaming, just go to the Analytics, where you can get the usage, top ranking and viewer counts. Well, that's it for an overview of Cloud Live. For any questions, you can visit our help center to find more on Cloud Life features. And for more help, just contact us at 24 7 Customer Service. Thanks for watching and enjoy your live streaming on Cloud Live.